Hello and welcome to another video. And for those of you who are new to the channel, every week I make a little skit with my son Luca. It goes at the start of my Sunday video and it's safe to say that you guys enjoy them. So towards the end of last year, and as a little bit of a like 300,000 subscriber special, I made a Luca intro compilation and it went down pretty well. Now we fly to Australia tomorrow morning, right? So I thought to myself, what video can I make that's gonna require the least amount of effort possible, you know, because I've got to pack all of our stuff, we've got to sort out car hire, travel insurance, all that kind of stuff. So the last thing I wanna be doing is stressing out about making a video. But at the same time, I wanna bring you guys a midweek video. So I got thinking, that last intro compilation was quite a while ago. Since then, I've made at least like 20 more intros, most of which are friggin' sick. Plus, I'm about to hit 500,000 subscribers on the channel, which is pretty mind-blowing. So I thought, you know what? Let's make another one. And so here we are. So before we get into this video, which let's face it, it's going to be incredible. I'm going to ask for two small things in return. Firstly, you drop this video a like. And secondly, you subscribe if you are new to the channel. Right. Game on. Oh, morning, bro. You all right? Oh, sorry, mate. Hang on. Whose phone is that? And who are you talking to? Okay, don't say that, sir. Sorry, Dad. That's my agent. Your agent? Yeah. Okay. One. Two. Hey, Luca. Wait. Three. What are you? Four. Luca, where is all that money from? Luca? Uh, Christmas present? Right. No price of seven ninety nine. Right, seriously, what is going on? Nothing bad. Well, it's not nothing, is it? What are you up to? Luca. So you want big biceps? What are you doing? Luca, what have I told you about fighting? It was not fighting, it was Greco Roman wrestling. Why are you Greco Roman wrestling? And then the castle, Dad. Right. I mean, Greco-Roman wrestling definitely isn't part of the decathlon, but fair enough. How are you getting on? Struggling, mate. Really? What? What's happened? They flopped the diving. Right. Broke my skis. Yep. And crossed my horse. Your horse? You've got none of those events in the decathlon, but whatever. What events have you got left? Last event, Dad. Last event? Jeez, what is it? Again, not actually a part of the decathlon, but okay, Luca, you can do this, mate. Come on, take this one seriously. Let's get the win here, yeah? Don't worry, Dad. I've got this. How many times? Stop calling me big boy. I'm back in my bag. Ooh, where are you going? Uh, nowhere. Dad? Okay, it's kind of awkward, but we're going skiing. Awesome, I can't wait. No, look at your not. <coughs> Luca, just mummy and daddy going. <coughs> Can you stop doing that? Thank you. Now, I know it's hard, right, but maybe we go skiing this time Nick. What are you doing? I'm trying to pack those things. Look, I'm really sorry. You're just too young to come skiing now, all right? I promise if we go next year, you can come, all right? Okay, no. I understand. 
Okay. Now I feel bad. Where have you gone? The hell? Happy birthday, big boy. Happy birthday, to big boy. Happy birthday, to big boy. Happy birthday, to big boy. Thanks, mate. I'd rather you call me Happy dad. Happy birthday, to big boy. Happy birthday, to yeah. big boy. Happy birthday, okay, to big boy. Okay, can we stop now? Boy. Sorry, just quite annoying. Happy birthday. Hey guys! Oh, thanks, Luca. Ah, exciting. Uh, okay, uh, these for men? Yep, put them on. Right, okay. I'm sure this looks good, yeah? Dad. You look gorgeous. Oh, thanks, bro. Appreciate that. Hey, guys, may I have another one? Yes! Thanks, Luca. Best birthday ever. Wait, isn't... Isn't that a woman's sports bra? Guys, you're born to wear that. Do you know what? You're right. Luca, I'm really not sure if I can pull this off. O and D. That is perfect. Really? Look at my face, Dad. I'm serious. Okay, because I've got to go train now, so like it wouldn't be weird if I wore this. Go and get them, Tiger. All right, awesome. I'm going. What the hell are you doing? Luca, why are you sitting in a cupboard? We need to talk. Right, I mean, I'm going to take you out of the cupboard. Okay, what do we need to talk about? Don't patronise me, Dad. I'm not patronising you, Luca. I literally have no idea what you're on about. Talk about what? A contract. What? We don't have a contract. We do now. Right, what is the contract for? I Sons. Okay. My salary. Yep. My needs. Your needs. What needs? Number one, I need a car. A car of what? Your ad revenue. Okay. I mean, I've brought everything you own, but fair enough. Anything else? I'm not a dressing room. Luca, you have a room. You don't need a dressing room. That's not happening. Hmm. We'll see about that. Well, we won't. You're not having a dressing room. Number three. More holidays. Right, you come on holidays with us all the time. Why do you need more holidays? I'm stressed right now, Dad. Luca, you spend your days eating Weetabix and playing with your trains. What part of that is stressful? I don't have to listen to this. Immature? I'm guessing I don't. Yeah, good luck with that. See you Drama queen. Yeah, I heard what you said, Luca. I'm just confused as to what's happening right now. And where did you get that stick from? I am Gandalf the Grey. Luca, you look nothing like Gandalf. Right, I mean, you just put your dressing gown on there, haven't you? Okay, listen, I see what you're trying to do. I just feel like the lack of a beard is the main issue here. <laughs> you look like Colonel Saunders. Fine, I could put a rest Drew, that's a good effort. Now can I get past, I need the toilet. Where's the ring, Frodo? Right, admittedly, I am wearing a ring, but I'm not Frodo. Take it off, Frodo, it's dangerous. 
Luca, it's not dangerous, it's just like a standard wedding ring. Stop calling me Frodo. What to the Shire, Hobbit? I don't live in the Shire and I'm not a friggin' Hobbit. Luca, I'm just gonna have to go, mate. I need the toilet. You're the word of Right, firstly, Gandalf doesn't even say that. That's from Harry Potter. And secondly, I haven't got time for this. I'm going to the toilet. Be careful what you want. Good, but whatever. Any reason for this? Find a relaxing. Right. So if it's a little bit of squat. Oh cheers, Luca, that'll be awesome. Back in a minute. What? Where are you going? Good, fairly offensive stereotype there. Can we just get on with the cooking now? I'm starving. Luca, what is this? You like the same, Dad. Do you know anything? <laughs> what are you doing in here? No, Luca, I won't relax. You just left the house without telling me and then gone and sat in my car. Are you sure about that? Yes. And how did you even get in? What do you think, Mark? Right, give those back. Okay, back inside, let's go. Oh, there's five more minutes, please. Fine. Look, I'm going to go in. I'll come back and get you in five minutes, right? Do not touch anything. Oh, the boss. Thank you. Jeez. Sick blood rush. 
Okay, I'm very excited to be fair. Let's see this bad boy. Look at what the hell. I've been sat here for two hours like an absolute goon and you've drawn a dog on a skateboard. It's abstract, Dad. Okay, that's great, but it's definitely a dog on a skateboard. I can't work like this. Morning, mate. Ready for your intro? Sorry, I can't do it today, Dad. What? Why not? I'm doing yoga. <coughs> okay. I mean, I wasn't aware you were into yoga, but fair enough. Reschedule for tomorrow, yeah? Yep. Come on. Morning. It's intro time. Let's go. Do I have to take away? Luca, you said that yesterday. Why can't you do it today? I'm having breakfast in bed. Where did you even get that from? Wouldn't you like to know? Uh, yes, that's why I asked. Anyway, it doesn't matter. We we'll definitely do the intro tomorrow, yeah? We got it. Morning, Luca boy. Today's the day, mate. It's intro time. No, you can do, big boy. Are you joking? What could you possibly have to do that's more important than our intro? I'm watering the house cards today. Oh, I'm sorry, but this is ridiculous. Have you seen my schedule? I've got like three meetings today, maybe four meetings. They're probably going to overrun, so I won't be done till super late. Then I've got to get Instagram pics, edit them, sort out the captions and stuff. The day after that, I'm getting a train to Manchester. Realistically, we won't be back for like probably two days. That's assuming there's no delays. You know what public transport's like. You can understand why I need to get the... Luca, where have you gone? Luca, what are you doing? Luca! Alright, sweetheart! Right, do not call me sweetheart, and what is happening here? I'm working, Dad. What? What work are you doing? Other than, like, banging a hammer against a ladder for about three hours? No, you no, know, Dad, bits and bobs. Right, I'm sorry, but I'm definitely going to need some more specifics here. You're wearing a helmet, standing up a ladder, holding a hammer, making a... Luca, that's our neighbour. She's like 75. Sorry, Dad. You should be. It's really embarrassing. Maybe I've got a screw loose. That's not funny. Oh, I stop banging on about it. Luca, this is not the time for jokes. Come on, I know you need. Luca, I'm serious. I saw a film about metal work last night. Right, I don't have time for this. It was riveting. Hello, Hello, Luca. Just come by and look at you. Luca, I'm not. Where did he find that hat? Found it there in the saloon. What saloon? What does that even mean? Get ready, little lady. Right, don't call me little lady and get ready for what? Here's cold for breakfast. Right, that doesn't make any sense. Have you literally lost your mind? Can I ask you a question? Yeah, why not? I'm not answering that. And don't play with bananas. You're a little belly rat. Did you just call me a yellow bellied rat? Say that again and you're definitely grounded. Get 
gonna have to make my dad. Why? What are you gonna do? Throw it up? What are you? What the hell are you doing? You throw? Stop throwing bananas! You're gonna bruise them. You lunatic!